so I'm the problem for returning the favor. He should pack his bags because the moment I go upstairs, I'm packing my bags and he better brings everything downstairs. We are going home tonight. He's not serious. Today, that house, that breakup, we are mm. going home. Pack your bags. Mm. <laughs> Sorry for the laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the laugh. <laughs> As you all are watching this particular video, Chiwe has already concluded, but she is yet to just execute her concluded conclusion of her going upstairs to just pack her entire bags. And Zion, on the other hand, will also pack his entire bags. Both Zion and Chiwe are going to just vacate Biggie's villa. When I heard her say that, I just screamed at the top of my voice and said, Biggie, please just open your door. Uh -huh one pair down plus the pair of time that was evicted last sunday then 12 pairs to go but she did not do so she still went on and to just shout and said how much is money that no matter how much she has just spent in the course of coming to biggest villa that she's going to just make it before this year's december speaking about december 2024 she also said that she has a lot of businesses that she is doing that she's a pronounced businesswoman that she has a lot of investment and she's going to just get the return of the money and she also went for that to complain who the f u c k is zion why would zion just tell her that his zion is going to bring onyeka to chimwe that chimwe is going to apologize to onyeka onyeka will also apologize to chimwe and that is it and chimwe must apologize that if chimwe is not going to apologize to onyeka that they are going to just break up chimwe was like who the hell is zion for zion to just threaten her chimwe with break up therefore they have broken up in fact let them break up in fact she has already declared break up don't want peace i want problems always and she was ranting to dj flo dj flo on the other hand was calmly listening to her understanding chinwe's mood did i also tell you there was a fight yes so chizoba almost fought with chinwe onyeka got involved then as mwani noticed that onyeka has involved herself in the fight that is happening between chinwe and chizoba mwani died into the fight after all if chizoba and onyeka are sisters then chinwe is also Mwane's mama. Twisted gist, right? I am certainly going to just untwist this particular gist and make it plain for you all to understand. But before I do so, let me quickly welcome you all to my most fabulous, most interesting, and most intriguing channel of mine, If It's Star Wars. And here on my channel, my only singular obligation is to always update and entertain you guys with unsentimental, unbiased, and non judgmental analytic analysis of the ongoing Big Brother Ninja season 9. No lose guard. I don't do childish shit. Face me. Face me. Now, child. Child is bitch. Uh, uh, really. My dad's supposed to go outside for me, but it's calm. <laughs> Let me take fresh air. This afternoon, after Big Brother announced that the entire housemate had to just do their second sponsor tax that is proudly sponsored by Checkers Custard, they were also divided by each group. While the entire housemates in groups are all preparing for their sponsor tax presentation, a fight ensued between Chizoba and Chiwe. Onyeka got involved. Wane got involved. Why are they fighting? I am certainly going to explain, but before I do so, please, if this is the first time ever you are coming across my channel, please do patronize me by simply clicking on the red icon down below to you, subscribe to my channel, and also do endeavor to turn on, on the notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button. Its function is to always notify you once I upload a new video, and also feel free to give this particular video a huge thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comment section according to us seen on social media because i have to just tell you guys that i went out this afternoon according to what chingwe explained to her group that chizoba was looking for their cup and she now assumed that it was the group that chingwe belonged to stole or took the cup so while she was in search of the cup and chingwe decided to just humbly just offer her another cup and while chingwe was about to give her the cup somebody else brought another cup and she was like you people should just stop stealing the cup chingwe did not love the way chizoba said that and she fled up and chizoba now retorts to chingwe by saying that you are very rude remember that chizoba has already bottled up one or two for chingwe being that ben has already told chizoba that why ben was just going upstairs in the beginning of this week that Check us. 
Ah, the pair that Chingwe wants to see Lee Biggie's house. Of course, we have already had that conversation between Zion and DJ Flo. And Chingwe said that to Zion and DJ Flo while they were having that conversation. I think it was on Monday after they just returned from the head of the house ballot challenge. Yes, Chingwe said that if the checkers pair are to just appear once again for the second time in the bottom four, that they are certainly going to just leave Biggie's villa. Yes, Ben had right, of which Ben communicated to Chizoba. Chizoba, on the other hand, has already reported to Biggie during the checkers direct section that took place on Tuesday. Now, because Chizoba has gotten that opportunity, she utilized it very well to just get back at Chiwe. Chiwe, on the other hand, who also has one or two reserved anger and yet to just express fight for Chizoba or rather the pairs of checkers decided to also fire back at Chizoba. And Onyeka, of course, noticing that her sister is just fighting Chiwe, just have to just get herself involved. Remember that they are pairs, aren't they? Now, one from nowhere, just noticing that Onyeka and Chizoba are already fighting Chiwe, she decided to just dive into that. And the next thing, she's already calling Onyeka name, saying that Onyeka is a whatever word that has to do with B-I-T-C-H-S. And the next thing, you know, Wani is asking Onyeka, who the F-U-C-K are you? I loved the way Onyeka replied Wani by saying, I am a qualified lawyer. And you, can you please introduce yourself to just not to your fellow housemates, but also to the entire viewers? And Wani replied Onyeka, I am a DJ. Oh, wow. Handy. Noticing that her twin sister is just fighting. Have to just go there to drag her sister out and immediately start scolding her by just warning her seriously for getting involved in a fight that has nothing to just do with her. And according to Wani, if not that Chinwa calls me baby and I address Chinwa as mama, I wouldn't have involved myself. And I have to also tell you guys that immediately Wani got involved in that fight, Chinwa decided to just keep quiet because Wani has already taken over the fight too if not that her sister came to just drag her out at the right time and after that Wani let her realize that she was absolutely wrong for getting herself involved in a fight that has nothing to do with her and her twin sister let her apologize to Onyeka alongside her twin sister after they were done with their checkers costard sponsor task and it was the way Onyeka was busy playing with the hair of Wani or was it even handy because these two were absolutely best of friends as at last week i didn't even know what changed and Chingwe noticing what was happening was not even happy it was even the fact that when they were doing that fight that Chingwe made mention that checkers would have been the pair that would have left biggie's house on sunday but she did not even know what happened Chingwe got angry and Chingwe was now seen having a conversation with dj flo while Chingwe is ranting to dj flo Chingwe is saying to dj flo that she is going to break up with zion for the second time in one week ever since Chingwe and zion made their way into biggest villa according to Chiwe. that this is not the first time that she is telling zion that once the housemate cannot just get to her that they are certainly just going to get to her through zion according to Chiwe, that zion told her that she is very very rude and this is what they have discussed with their gang while they were all gathering around the dining table and after they had that conversation instead of zion to just defend Chiwe, zion is not supporting them by also agreeing with everybody on that dining table that indeed Chimwe is rude. And Chimwe kept on ranting and she kept on saying that she could have not come to Biggie's house if not for Zion. That it is absolutely Zion that needs the platform most. According to Chimwe, that from the moment that they shot the video of their interview, from the moment that they told them that they are going to one of the housemates, too, that everything they have done, including the money spent, too, including the flight book, the fact everyone combo is coming out from her purse and she did not even. Even sent. So she's trying to tell us that she's the one sponsoring this particular relationship financially. She kept on saying that even if they was work out from Biggie's house, that she has nothing to lose, that she was about to even discuss oil and the gas business with her dad, that she has her businesses, she even wants to start her salon and spa. And it's because of Zion, she decided to just make the sacrifice by participating in this ongoing people that I just sees the night. She kept on ranting and ranting and ranting until DJ Flo was like, I just want to ask you a question and please just don't answer me this question as an angry woman 
but a sincere question and DJ Flo was like Chimwe just tell me why did you choose that you are going to pair with Zion because they have other best friends or you could have choose your blood relation why Zion and that was the moment Chimwe realized that she absolutely loved Zion she was like ah, it's not like I wanted it I have attempted three times and Biggie rejected me so I have already given up on Zion I just brought it to me I see the pattern or the concept that they just want to use to do this is big brother don't you think we should just attempt as boyfriend and girlfriend do and i decided to just reconsider it because i am just doing this for love and from chiwe's words that i also got to know that she has made series of sacrifice for this relationship whereas zion is yet to just make any therefore she is done she's going to just break up and she said that it has already happened before but zion have to apologize and she just choose to forgive but this time Miranda is not just going to happen no she went on and on and on and on no, until Biggie decided to just remove the camera not after she has already revealed every secret we need to know concerning their relationship especially how it has been happening outside Biggie's house that was when Biggie now ordered the head of the house to just come to the diary room and it is about time they start getting ready for their usual Thursday arena game and they are just dressed in their traditional attire. Chiwa could not even stand up from where she was sitting down. It was DJ Flo that helped her to just get her clothing. Kayo, they just have to locate Chiwa with his camera. Chiwa is just crying and crying and while she's crying, camera will just even show Zion not even regarding the presence of Chiwa. It was even DJ Flo and Ruti that went to just meet her and was even telling her to just share up and also just go and dress in her traditional attire she was like let me just gather myself when i'm done crying i'm just going to come upstairs dj flo is doing everything to make sure that chingwe is fine and in all of this zion no even sent chingwe rara i get the point of zion but let's just see how everything is certainly just going to end me i know say chingwe is just ranting chingwe is this kind of person just like she has already addressed herself as a boss lady what she wants is what is going to happen how she wants it is how it is going to be executed in fact as she did talk just the do one if not there is certainly just going to be a problem i know for sure that zion will never tolerate not even thinking of accommodating it was it not yesterday that Zion and Mickey were having a conversation and Zion was just showering praises and also telling Mickey that coming to this biggest house with Chinwe as a pair is the best ever decision that he has made. He went on and on to just explain that Chinwe is one of the best relationship that he Zion has ever had. Had. and from the way Zion was even speaking I felt that he Zion was the one that sponsored their coming only for Chimo to just make this shocking revelation today while having a conversation with DJ Flo at the garden I don't even know who to believe unless they're going to have a face-off where Chimo will say it direct to Zion's face then I will watch what Zion is certainly just going to reply as it is now housemates are getting ready for their usual Thursday arena game and Zion is here to speak to Chimo and Chimo on the other hand is also busy ignoring Zion I will see how it is certainly going to end and whatever it is that happens of course I am certainly going to just bring it to you guys on my most fabulous channel and until then I am still your favorite entertainer with continuous entertainment entertainment saying you are yet to subscribe and this is your first time ever coming across my channel please do so now smash on the red icon down below subscribe turn on the notification bell and give this video a huge thumbs up and i will conclude by saying that it is okay for you to just counter what i just said or choose to argue or oppose after all your favor is involved but please while you are at that please be civil whatever that happens like i said i will certainly update you guys and until then Bye bye. Remember, it is still Big Brother Nigeria season nine. No lose guard. Let's break up, pack our bags, and leave Biggie's house. Says Chiu. Nemo.